The Open Job button in PlanSwift will open up the Open Job dialog. Within the dialog we have toolbar across the top. On that toolbar we have our uh, job locations, local by default. Uh, with any new installation you'll always have local. For this example I've created a network job location. We have uh, job editing which would include deleting jobs, accessing the job properties, moving the location of the job, and then you have uh, the ability to customize this view with additional columns, and the close button will just close the dialog. As you can see, I have a few jobs in my local directory. I also have uh, a job in my network directory. In my local directory, if I need to edit this job, I'll simply click on the job, highlight it. I can select my Properties button. It'll open the Properties window, click Advanced. From here, I can edit the job name. Um, I could add additional properties, edit the job description, put some notes in. If I want to delete this job, again, I'll select the job click the delete job button. At that point I would be prompted if I'm sure I want to delete that job I would select yes or no. If I needed to move one of these jobs again I would select the job I wish to move. Click my move to button and that's going to give me a drop down that reflects my different locations. I'll select the network you'll see that job just moved to the network. Uh, the columns button will open up a dialog where you can add additional columns. Um, I've got a couple created here. Now these are based on the property names so as long as the property name matches the column name the information will show. So if I were to click on uh, my notes as being visible you'll see a note that I had created on on a job here on the 9.0 sample plan job shows up. You can delete and add additional columns and close that dialog. Now to open the job, as easy as it sounds, go to the job you want and simply select the open job button. Plan Swift will load your job and you are ready to start working.